Critical levels for ICP, massive update here. Let's jump right into it. Smash those likes, hit that subscribe if you haven't already, guys. So these are the levels for ICP that I'm looking at right now. I told you guys about this last week, about if we broke above 12 to expect this $15 to be massive resistance, and that's what's been happening right now. So this last week range, we broke above it. We broke above 12. We've, re we've come back today, retested 12, and has been holding as support. Massive wick down here, right back up. If you were able to get in here at $12 or sub 12, that was a great, great pickup right there. But as you guys can see, this weekly range for the new year, we've been retesting this $15 massive resistance where it's not just right above the value area high for this week, but it's also the value area low of a previous range from back in 2022, which is going to be a lot of resistance. But if we are to flip this level, if we can stay above 15, as you guys can see here, we swing failed back here. Let me zoom in. We swing failed back here on the third, and we're not able to stay above it. But if we can stay above and close a candle up here on the daily, on the four hour, whatever it is, and we start accumulating above $15, these are the levels to be looking out for. Right. The levels are as simple as this. Let me zoom out a little bit here for you guys. All right. These are the levels to look out for. Point of control of this range. If we break above the $14, $15 and we stay above that and and we get into this quarter one range from the year 2022, the, the point of control up here is $19. That's going to be the next big support, the next big resistance that we're going to have to flip as support. Outside of that, between 20, between 19 and 20, there's going to be some massive resistance here. Another key level is $20, but the value area high of this of this range, if we rotate the full range, is $24, which is almost from where we're at right now. If I drop back down to the four hour where we are, is almost, almost double from where we're at right now. We're sitting at 14 five right now as we speak we could drop a little bit lower by the time you see this video or we could be higher but at this point it would be almost double right if we were down at 12 dollars, it would be exactly double from where it's at so it's a massive run it's a massive range i don't expect us to have a massive blast off i just expect us to start ranging and start accumulating some support within this level this blue zone up here if not if we do not do that if we get rejected here hard and we head back down obviously the next point of control is 13 Big value area, big value area low is twelve ninety, and I will see the twelve thirty two, and then if we break below this and close below this, also puts us into the previous week range. If we rotate that full range to the downside, the value area, the point of control for that previous week range is nine dollars and forty nine cents. Value area low is eight dollars and seventy five cents. That would be a drop of about from where we're at right now to down here would be about thirty eight percent. Be a huge drop. I don't foresee this happening unless the entire market takes a turn for the worst. Outside of that, I think ICP is looking very strong, very bullish. It's staying above levels and breaking up, even with Bitcoin's massive retracement today with the ETF news. So with that being said, I'm super bullish on ICP. I've been packing my bags since like three bucks. Let me know in the comments what you guys have been doing. What do you guys think about ICP? Hit that subscribe. Hit that like if you haven't already. Until next time, see ya.